32 year old Josh. Josh is on his way to our sting motel room to meet what he thinks is a young girl. But secretly, I'm waiting there with my investigation team to ask him a few questions. And you won't believe how he ends our interview. You're on the way right now. His name is Josh. He's a he's a good looking guy, I would say. Looks like he embodies success. So successful, in fact. Josh is not coming here by his own means of transport. I had to pay her. What he thinks is this 14 year old girl had to pay for this man to Uber over to our Sting Motel, where we are obviously set up at, and there's more than a 14 year old girl. My bodyguard here, Ale, he, he's real efficient. Actually, has met this man before, interestingly enough. He sold him, he sold him life insurance, I believe, Ale? But there wasn't much time for chat as we got into position. Watch as Josh waste no time with this young girl. I have a seat right over there for me. Okay. You got an idea on you? No. No idea on you? No. Nope. See you right there, sir. Where are you doing tonight, man? Met somebody on Grinder. You met someone on Grinder? Yeah. Who'd that be? Uh, her. Who's, her. who's she? Her name's Tristan. Tristan? How old is Tristan? She told me she was 14 when I was texting. She what? Told me I was 14 when she when I was texting me. She told me she was 14 and she we were texting her. Yeah. So what are you doing here with a 14-year-old in a motel room? I don't know. You don't know? In the chat logs, it seemed like you knew. In the chat logs? In the chat logs, oh. it seemed like you knew. So you want to cuddle with her, maybe more? I mean, when I walked out here, you, you have less than what you have on now. All right. So what were you trying to do, man? Let's be honest with you. Hang out and just cuddle. Cuddle? Yeah. Just cuddle. Yeah. When I walked out, you're in the process of taking your clothes off. So it looked like you wanted to do more than cuddle. Right. I mean, do you really expect me to believe you just came here to cuddle? No. You were going to cover your clothes off with a 14-year-old girl. And you think that's appropriate? No. You have each other to drone? No. Wife? Girlfriend? No. Uh, I mean, how old are you, Josh? 35. You're 35 years old? Yes. And you stumble upon this 14-year-old on Grinder, and you come over to... You think your parents are home and, and cuddling and kiss her? That's what she said. That's what you said? Well, she told me when she was texting her parents no, in the living room. that's what you said. And you can't say that's what she said. When I walked out, you did not have many clothes on, my friend. So it's not just what she said, it's what you were doing. I mean, what do you think should happen? I know I probably can go to jail. Well, it's not up to me to decide, but uh, do you think you, that's something you deserve for coming here tonight? If I was in a... It was, if I was thinking straight, then I would have said no. If you were thinking straight, you would have said no. I come here. Why weren't you thinking straight, Josh? 
Just in North Preston Company. Just looking for some company. Yes. And you couldn't find any other company on a Friday night. I mean, I mean, we Uber huh. to here from downtown. It's a very busy place on the weekends. Well, of course, it's kind of wet and stuff out there too. Ah, uh, so you figure your next best thing is 14 year old in the hotel room. I mean, what do you have to say for yourself, man? Have you done this before? No. First time? Yes. So you're 35 and you're just comfortable enough to Uber up here and hop in a hotel room with the great thing is 14. I mean, what would happen if we weren't here? It would have gone a little bit further. A little bit farther? Yeah. You mind explaining? We would have laid down, cuddle, gotten a little bit further than that. Probably kiss, getting him to it heavy. You know what I mean? Getting, I don't know what you mean. I'm just trying to get understand. understanding. No, just, just like having sex. Okay, so you came here to have sex with a girl you believe you're 14. When she texted me, she said she was 14, so. What do you have to say to her? I'm she sorry. She was nervous. She was terrified. I'm sorry for doing that to you. If I was terrified, then I'm 25. Think about how an actual kid would have felt. Right. I mean, how would you feel if you had a 14 year old daughter of your own and a 35 year old man came over to have sex with her? Probably not good. No, I would I'd be pissed. Exactly. So I'm sure you can understand our frustration. Right. Are you happy that it's us here and not an actual 14 year old? Yes. Why? Because it could have turned out a lot worse than what, you know what I mean? We're all much younger than you and it's ridiculous that we have to lecture you. I'm not house. a teen. You're almost double my age. I, I can't believe what I'm seeing. You know? Mm hmm. Shoes on time, by the way. What do you do for a living, Josh? I work at a. Sunshine! Golf course right off of a. I mean, do you think it's safe for you to work in an environment where. There may be kids. After what I just saw tonight, I mean, you were. If I'd waited 20 more seconds in there, you would have been naked when I walked out. And that was in with what? You got to talk to for maybe two minutes? Mm -hmm. In two minutes of talking, you were about 14, you're getting naked? Why did you want this kid to be opening the door naked? Is that something that would have turned you on? Is that why you said it? Yeah, just out of curiosity, how long have you actually been doing this show? A little over a year. You ever watched shows like or videos like this before? No. Then you're gonna start? Yeah. <laughs> what were you thinking on the way here? Do you think this could be a setup? What was that did cross my mind that I was thinking it could be a setup. Do you feel like you were set up? No, yeah. Also, you reach out to this girl, you make contact. Well, after talking for a while, I was thinking this might be a setup, but I'm going to just... So the only thing that would deter you from doing what you did tonight was the fact that it could be a setup. Yeah. Not the fact that it's a fortune. Yeah. How did you think the 14-year-old had money to Uber you over here? No idea? Nope. Didn't get that far. Not much of a thinker? Just more on the fly, you know what I mean? Gotcha. Thinking with the wrong head tonight, eh? Yeah. Now what's to stop you from thinking with the wrong head again? This tonight. I hope so. Did you bring anything with you here? Uh, just my phone, my keys, my door card for where I live at. And condoms? Yeah. No. No. So you're gonna have a 14 year old girl with no condoms? Do you have a way to get home? Were you playing that far? I know you said kind of what was your rest of the night looking like. Did you have a way to get back or? No, I didn't. Okay. Did you do it right? Maybe. You said the reason why you won't be doing this again is because we were here, right? So let's say Correct. we weren't here and this was a 14 year old, okay? And everything was going fine for you. Would you do it again? If this was a 14 year old and everything went smooth for you? Probably not. Why not? With them being underage, it's me the first time with that. It's like. The underage is only a problem after you've had sex with them one time. Once is the cutoff, after that, then it's bad. Are you close with your uh, family, your parents? I am with my mom, yeah. What do you think she's gonna have to say when she sees this? She doesn't really watch this 
stuff. She's gonna be mad. Do you wanna tell her yourself? Give her a call? Or do you think it's better she get it from the police versus you? I'll give her a call. I think that's fast, Josh. Yeah, she's even her wake right now. Hey, Mom. Hey, what's up? Um, I got myself caught up in something. What? Um, just something bad. I can't think of how to explain it. Is it bad or good? It's, it's bad. What did you do, Josh? I got caught up in one of those, uh, in a sense, predator shows. A what? Yeah. I got caught up in one of those predator shows. This one's a YouTube thing. Who turned you in? Somebody who told me they were 14. You were talking to a girl that, but, but were you talking to somebody that was a, were you talking to a girl? Yeah. Oh, Josh. How old did she tell you she was? 14. So why were you talking to her? You know you can't. You know you're not supposed to do that. Do you need me to come out there? No. Are you sure? Because I don't want you going back to jail. No yeah, I don't want to go either. Cops on the way to this place to talk to you. No, I'm not at Exodus. Where are you? <laughs> Red Roof Inn off of... Why are you with Red Roof Inn? Who are you with? The people with that Predator show that's on YouTube. I was here to meet somebody for some companionship. Why did you do that? You have to work in the morning. I know, it was my mistake and I should have done it in the first place. No, you shouldn't have. No, I am truly thankful that they stepped in because it would have turned out worse, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you could, go to, you could go back to jail or prison even, Josh. I know. All right, bye. Bye. Just out of curiosity, what would happen if the girl told you she was 13? If she was 13? Mm. Would it have changed the outcome? Or? Yeah, Why? I would have said, I would have said no. Why? That's way too young of a... 14 isn't much older. Why is 13? Way too young, but then 14 isn't way too young. 14 year olds I've talked talk to before I got in trouble and all that mm. have more sense of what's going on. So you have talked to kids before? As friends, yes. How do you compare that to 13 year olds? You also talk to 13 year olds as friends? I don't know many 13 year olds. So then how do you know it's a 13 is too young, but 14 is a little more mature? It's just a well. Yes. Would you say you're a predator, Josh? After tonight, yeah. Oh, Josh, this is your last opportunity to say anything you may have to say. Any parting words? Words of wisdom from Josh? Uh, words of wisdom, just don't make a mistake like I did. Please look for the red flags. And I really can't think of anything else right now. So your parting message is look for the red flags if it's not a real 14-year-old girl. Mm -hmm. Other predators, keep your eyes peeled. Okay. And after the longest and definitely smelliest hour of my life, the police entered for their own questioning, leaving Josh as it currently stands under investigation. What's your name, sir? Josh. Josh? Yes. Alright, you want to come outside and talk to me real quick? 